Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to make an internet detector in Scratch. Yes, one that doesn't require you to reload the page or restart the project or do anything silly like that. It's just live. So if you want to see how to make those, then don't forget to like, subscribe and share. And we'll get on with the video. So of course, we have to put our when green flag click block and we want a forever loop. So it always detects it and it is live. Now, put an if then else block, which some people just call an if else, and I'll just put it here. Now, this will forever detect whatever is in here. Now, we need something to be able to detect the internet. So the only real things that can detect internet in Scratch are the extensions. Now, the music pen, video sensing, and makey makey cannot actually detect internet because they don't require internet. But the micro bit, Lego boost, text to speech, translate, and lots more do require internet. Now, we can't use these five on the bottom because they need physical objects. Like the micro bit needs the actual micro bit microchip, I guess. And the text to speech and translate are the only ones we can use. Now, we don't want our project to be talking to us while we're trying to record. So let's just put translate. Now, it's currently set to German, but you can set it to whatever you like. Let's look for J here. Japanese will work. So you can put the timer variable in there since it keeps changing and put it in here. Now, you may be wondering why I'm using timer because I'm trying to translate a number to Japanese, but it will still work just fine. So take out an equals sign and put the whole script into the left side. And now if there is no internet, it will leave a blank space. But if there is, then we can put a not. It will give us some funny number in Japanese. So we can put that inside here. This is their internet detector. Now you should have two costumes that says internet detected and internet not detected. So they will basically show whenever internet is detected or not. So when internet is detected, we can put a switch costume to detected and not. So make sure it's in this specific order. And at the beginning, we wanted to hide while we're calculating. And of course, since it's hidden now, we need to show as soon as we know. So if I press the green flag, you can see internet's detected. But if I turn off my internet, you can see now that internet is not detected. So let me just turn that back on. Yep, that works completely fine. And I didn't have to press the green flag or anything. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. It was so much. I know it was quite a long tutorial for a tiny script, but I think I explained it very well. And some of you guys have been complaining about how fast I was talking. So don't forget to like, subscribe and share if you enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.